Vampires have gotten themselves a bad name lately, with some odd, albeit popular choices made on how they're portrayed. Let's talk about why I rank vampires as number 9 in my top 10 scariest D&D monsters. <laughs> Hi everyone, my name is Justin and welcome to Game On, a channel all about tabletop gaming from RPGs to board games and everything in between. This year for Horror Gaming Month, we're going over our top 10 scariest D&D monsters in my opinion. Today, we're going to discuss the vampire. So, we're not talking about the infamous Strahd von Zanovich, but the general stat block for vampires found in the Monster Manual. These CR-13 monsters invoke the terror that one used to feel about vampires before pop culture turned them into glampires. And I can't believe that that word just came out of my mouth. Vampires are scary creatures in D&D because they always have a way of escape, and truly killing one is quite hard. Legendary Resistance, Misty Escape, Regeneration, and Spider Climb makes it hard to lock down a vampire and truly kill it. The vampire's ability to not only hurt your HP, but also drain your max HP from a max of 18 on 3d6 is pretty harrowing from its bite attack, and even for 2nd and 3rd tier characters, that's still a good chunk of your hit points. And the fact that vampires are usually accompanied by their spawn also makes them a harder threat to deal with. If you come into contact with a vampire in and around its home, a thick fog will stick around making everything heavily obscured, and it's almost as if the shadows around you move on their own. Getting into a fight with a full-fledged vampire and their cohort of minions, or even just on their own, is enough to even make the most hardened player shiver just a little bit. So this is where I want to hear from you all. I rank the vampire number 9 on this list because of my interactions with it as a player in the DM. Have you ever met one in game as a player or used this monster as a DM yourself? How would you rank this monster? Let us know in the comments below. As always, a like on this video will help us know we're making content that you want to see. And don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already. Once again, my name is Justin and from the bottom of my heart, I thank you all for watching. Have a great spooky season, and as always, game on.